is Grace, and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is The Walls Go Up, Nehemiah and Ezra. Let's read. Nehemiah was the king cupbearer to king of Persia. Nehemiah heard that Jerusalem was in ruin and that his friends there were in trouble. He asked God to help them. So Nehemiah was the king's copper of Persia. But in her in his hometown, Jerusalem was ruined. He heard that Jerusalem was ruined, but and also their friends were in trouble. So he prayed for them. God gave Mimia the courage to speak to the king as rocks. Nehemiah asked if he could go to Jerusalem and help them fix their walls. So God gave the courage to speak to the king and he <coughs> agreed that so he left for Jerusalem. Nehemiah didn't care <coughs> that Jerusalem was in the ruins. False. He asked to the king for Jerusalem. Nehemiah walked around Jerusalem. Things were even more worse than he had here. This will be a big job. He told the people, but with God's help, we can rebuild this wall. <coughs> so Nehemiah looked around it and walked around it, Jerusalem, <coughs> and uh, things were more worse than he has here. <coughs> so he told the people, this will be a big job but with God's help we can rebuild the wall. <laughs> Faithfulness. Everyone worked in families and groups fixing the gates. First, they fixed the sheep gate, the fish gate, and the dung gate, and the other gates. Then they started to rebuilding the walls. <clears throat> Everyone worked in families and groups, and they fixed the gates. Then <clears throat> they started to rebuild the wall. <laughs> when they were rebuilding the walls, some person didn't. Some persons, person didn't. Uh, some people didn't like that because. Mm -hmm. 
and they also like beat them. But Yim Yang knew that they can finish rebuilding with God's help. My brother has me. They help each other. Question: Did Nehemiah believe the the walls of Jerusalem could be rebuilt with God's help? Yes, he knew that they could rebuild the wall of Jerusalem with God's help. First, their enemies laughed, but as the walls grew higher, those enemies prepared to attack. So God's people worked with a tool in one hand and a sword in the other hand. Like the first enemy, first their enemy laughed at them. Like, how can you rebuild a wall? You have to like build it higher if you're going to rebuild it. And but the walls go grow higher, so those enemy prepared to attack. So they work with one hand and with the other hand. Mm, what I have to say. And mm, they had a sword in the other hand. I don't like that sound. <laughs> After just 55, uh, 52 days, the walls was finished. Ezra, the priest, read God's rule to the people. They promised to obey God's rule and praised Him for protecting them. So, like after just 52 days, and these days they did also didn't have electricity. So, with their hands, they worked it. But the walls was finished at 52 days. With God's help, they believed that God will help them. So, it's they could rebuild it. Question. After the wall were finished, who saw God's rule to the people? Number one, the king of Persia. And number two, maybe... Um... Yemya's friend and number three the priest number three was the correct answer yes today i read the bible story did enjoy it and next time i'll read another good story then let's see you next time bye